Hi, this is Johnny from Zoot Woman, and you're watching Intro. For us playing, from that point of view, for us playing, it, it is, it's, a, it's a lot better. It's a great feeling to have finished a, a finished record and playing those new songs. Because for ages we've been gigging and playing these songs not quite finished and wondering how they're going to sound when they are finished but now we've done it it's it's uh, it's a good feeling um but i think yeah and also we did berlin festival which was a very different affair three years ago is when we did it 2006 and uh it wasn't in this area this is and i've never been here before and it's an amazing thing to see i haven't even been in the festival area yet but uh, yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's a great thing. I think ha everything goes hand in hand. It's exciting to be doing a new record, performing that, and to be doing an event like this as well. It all it makes it all very special. Mm. Well, we've always been writing and we've always been producing, uh, but uh, um, we've only kind of got to that stage where I think we're properly kind of satisfied with what what we came up with for this record because you know you can write and write but uh, we for a long time had a lot of question marks over songs we were doing and uh, and it, it took it just took it just took longer I think I think there was a lot of anticipation from us a lot of anticipation from people who want, wanted to hear it and for that reason we were rewriting a lot of stuff and uh, I've only just got to that stage where we're like yeah this is Creatively, it's as far as we want to take it right for this record, and, and so we've, we've let we, we left it at that, and and we I think I mean I'm I'm very happy with it. No, I I kind, of, I kind of always had it in my head that we'd at least do get to the finished record. I think we we've, we we haven't been as well united in the studio until recently. That's why we've we ended up finishing it. But uh, uh, it's funny that that question's actually come up quite a lot, and. You know, people said, you know, did you think that was going to be the, it was not going to be made? And I never, I didn't really sort of think of it as dramatically as that. I just kind of thought of it as songs, they're not finished, they need to be, kind of. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, I think what, what happened was we had very separate occupations for a while. Adam and I have been gigging, you know, Zoot Woman a lot over the last two or three years. Stuart's been involved in a lot of other projects. And it was just getting the physical time together, and I think, yeah, I think it was just the communication, you know, of, of, of getting everybody together at the same time, and having the songs at a stage where you can just spend a month together and finish it off, and that, so that that, that was kind of what what did it, I think. Uh, only, I mean, yeah, we, there were slightly different approaches. I mean, like before, Zootman was always always in the studio, finish the songs, and then take them perform them live and the difference this time was that we performed sort of kind of auditioned a lot of these songs uh, not really auditioned but just you know just played them at different gigs and then wrote them again and then played them again and then wrote them again and then so it was a bit of a reverse process we did, were doing more live and it was a case of getting back into the studio whereas in the past it was always the other way around so uh, yeah, I'm not sure if it was the right way to do it, but it's kind of, it's you know I think you have to take different I think third time around you have to try at least a slightly different approach. Well, funnily enough, we did do, recently put out a remix competition with one of our songs, uh, and we've had loads of different uh, results in. It's a really really good results actually. It's really interesting people taking the sort of bones of something you've had, a song you've kept to yourself for ages, and and then you know doing their own thing to it it's uh, it's really it's really good yeah well i mean obviously touring and promoting this record is step 1 but i think i think you know we were always writing and i think we're conscious of the fact that this record took a very long time to do so i think our intention is to carry on writing and producing and maybe trying something new out and uh I think I think it's important to leave the door open to a lot of things as well because I think you can get set in your ways in a band, particularly if you've been there a while. You know, you can you end up thinking this is what we do and you know this is how we do it. But I think whereas, whereas when you start out, you, you're younger and you have all these different ideas, you take a bit more in. I think it's good to retain that at least a bit of that, um, and I, I think we'll probably do that with uh, with with the next thing we write.